Hi, in this video, we will take a look what happened to a battery when it only had a maximum capacity of 51% left on iPhone 6 compared to a brand new battery. So here I'm just gonna, you can see also say um, when the maximum capacity is very low, the battery percentage drop extremely fast. So here it is, I'm gonna turn it off. So now we we'll let the phone turn off and then we're going to open up this ring. So I'm just going to lift up the screen here. Pull out the screen. Okay, now we're just going to take out the battery. And before we do that, we need to uh, remove the screen and the LCD. So I'm just going to disconnect our cables. So here at the bottom of the battery, there is a tab. You need to pull the tabs. And this will allow you to slowly pull out the adhesive. The adhesive is like plastic, you can just pull it out. There are two of them you need to pull out. So pulling out this uh, adhesive, make sure you go slowly, don't pull too hard, otherwise you will break it. And once you pull out, you can uh, uh, free the battery. So we're just gonna disconnect the flex cable right there, and then we can take out the battery. Battery, this is the damaged battery. This is a new battery, you can see it's nice and flat over here. This one here is bulging up and swollen. You can see the new battery is nice and thin, whereas the damaged one is really swollen. So that's what happened inside your phone when the phone capacity go down all the way down to uh, basically uh, 50%. It's very damaged. So you can see internally it is also damaged. And uh, that's the reason why your phone will not hold charge very well when it's uh, going all the way down to 50% health. And this one here is at 100% health. So it's nice and flat. And that's it. So if you want to continue watching the videos, so I'll show you how you can put the battery back. Okay, here, if you haven't got the proper battery pulling strip, we can use the double-sided tape. So I'm just gonna use the double-sided tape right here. Now we will put the battery back in. We connect the flex cables, and then also we connect the LCD. And make sure we put all the screw back on to hold everything down in place. So here is the new battery. Okay, here's the new battery. Go into settings, battery, uh, battery health. So it shows now battery maximum capacity is 100%. And that's pretty much it for uh, battery comparison and you can see now now you can see what happened to the battery when it is down to 51% health thanks for watching this video